Okay, lesson 15.5. This is selling price uh, using the markup based on selling price. Okay, your objectives are to calculate the selling price of an item based on cost and markup rate based on selling price. Selling price equals your cost divided by the complement of your markup rate. Okay, pretty easy formula today. Press pause while you get this copied and play when you're ready. Okay, let's go ahead and let's move on. Okay, our one and only example. BJ Sporting Goods Store knows from the past expense records, as shown below, that it must aim for a markup that is 40% of the selling price of its merchandise. The store received the shipment of running shoes at a cost of $38.99 per pair. What is the minimum selling price that the store should charge? Okay, note, the markup plus cost equals the selling price. If the markup is 40% of the selling price, then the cost must be 60% of the selling price because the complement of 40 is 60. Okay? All right, so the first thing we need to do is we need to find my complement. Well, if it says that my markup is 40%, okay, uh, take 100 minus 40, and you get the complement of 60. Okay? Now, next step, we get to use our formula. If the cost of my merchandise is $38.99, 38.99 divided by the complement of my markup, which is 60%. Okay, go ahead and work that out. 38.99 divided by 0.6 is 64.983 repeating. All right, so my answer: 64 dollars. And 98 cents. Okay, pretty simple. Let's go ahead and let's look at problems one and two. Press pause while you guys work these out and play when you're ready to see it. Okay, let's go ahead and work these. Number one it says a loaf of bread cost a buck forty and the markup is 30% of the selling price. Okay, 100. Minus 30 is 70. My cost is a dollar 40. Dollar 40 divided by 0.7. Plug that into your calculator. Dollar 40 divided by 0.7 is two bucks. Okay. Problem number two. Toothpaste costs a buck forty-nine. The markup is twenty-five percent of the selling price. One hundred minus twenty-five is seventy-five. Okay, dollar forty-nine divided by 0 0.75. That is a seven, not a two. One forty-nine divided by 0.75 equals 1.986 which is a dollar 99 okay simple lesson today here's your assignment lesson 15.5 page 569 1 through 13 and 17 get busy